All right, hello YouTube. Uh, we're gonna do an awesome video now, live on Twitch. I'm gonna do a character difficulty tier list. Oh, you guys are gonna love this one. Uh, but first off, I wanna talk a little bit about how I've been saying lately that Nina is, uh, you know, not the hardest character in the game. And a lot of people have been very angry with me. Nina players saying, have you tried the while standing one combo? It's super hard. And, and I'm like, oh, okay, okay. I feel like people don't really listen to what I'm saying. And um, when I determine how hard a character is, what some people do, people who post on Tekken Reddit or pro players is, they look at the pro level of Tekken and they say, how hard is it to play this character at pro level and that's literally all they do and sometimes they also take into equation execution i always hear nina main say the hardest characters in tekken are it's nina and lee and i'm like you're completely obsessed with execution are you not yes yes and it's like are you are you telling me nina is harder than gigas because I don't agree with you. But we're, we're gonna get into all of this. Um, but so what I wanted to say and why I'm holding this pen is I just wanna show uh, when I take a look at how hard a character is, you guys know me, I always divide the Tekken players into beginner, intermediate, and then I say high level, and then it's pro level. I, this is how I identify Tekken and Tekken players. Always have. And where, where do I fit in here? I would say I'm high. Maybe, baby, I'm making my way slightly in this direction. But I'm, I'm far away from a pro, pro player. Which is here. Um, but I'm... I'm a, I'm a high level player. Uh, so when I, for example, we're gonna put in Kazuya and Nina here because Nina mains always say Kazuya is much easier than Nina. And I tell them they are wrong, but do they have a point somewhere? Yeah, they do. Uh, let's see, I'm, I'm gonna go with red here. Can we see this? No, it's completely black. This is red. This is Kazuya's difficulty. In my opinion, Kazuya is one of the hardest characters to begin with. He's very hard on intermediates. At high level, he starts to become a little easier, but he's still a very difficult character. And at pro level, he goes down here. At pro level, I take for granted that, yeah, everyone you play has great skill in Tekken. And as soon as people have great skill in Tekken, they have equal skill, let's say Kazuya and Nina, I would say suddenly Kazuya is easier to play than Nina. Because at pro level, fundamentals are key, you know, and Kazuya, if you have fundamental skill, is a fantastic character. On paper, if two AIs are playing against each other with perfect skill, Kazuya is a much stronger character than Nina. He has the frames and he has the tools. Her pressure is great, but at this level, all of these strings I've been showing you guys, they do not work anymore. So if we were to put in Nina here, let's see if purple works. We have purple. I would say she's very easy at beginner due to her strings. She's easy at intermediate, but then her difficulty probably goes somewhere around that line, and I, I'm just drawing it out quickly, but I just want to show you guys what I do when I take a look at a character's difficulty, because to me, all of this is Tekken, you know. If we take a look at uh, how many people are in, in all of these player categories, you know, pro level, that's a little dot. It's a tiny, minuscule little dot. High level, maybe like that. Intermediate is a pretty chunky pizza. Beginner is a pizza you'll never see the end of. So what, what is the reality here of a character? 
Is it simply this, this little dot here? Is it one of the bigger dots? Or is it all of these dots? In my opinion, it's all of those dots. And that is why I say Nina, in general, is not one of the hardest characters in the game. Because I can't look uh, one of my students in his eyes, in his puppy eyes, you know, and say that. And when he says to me, oh, I get blown up by spammy Ninas uh, at warrior rank. And I try to punish with Kazuya, and I just say, yes, it's a, it's a fucking nightmare. She's super cheesy in those ranks. And players who play Nina, they get, get away with murder because the strings are so effective and they are so hard to counter. But you know what? One day you will have the skill to counter those strings easily, but you're gonna have to work real, real hard. You're gonna have to work much harder than those Nina players. But at this level, the Nina player has to do the harder work than the Kazuya player at this rank. Because you, your, your, your tool bag is so vulnerable compared to the Kazuya player. So, uh, that's what I wanted to say initially. Um, God damn it, that, that was actually a pretty long explanation. Maybe this should be a separate video. Maybe called how main man... No, main man explaining to Nina mains the reality. I'm gonna call it that. 